I probably shouldn't stalk this guy too much. Anyway guys, welcome back to OCRP, thank you so much for watching, and today we are once again a sheriff, not a sheriff, we're a highway patrol trooper. Um, oop, massive game lag, it happens occasionally, don't worry. But yeah, that vehicle was definitely um, suspicious. Hmm, I don't know. It's certainly worth keeping a uh, eye out for him. Is he trying to attract my attention or... What are you doing, bud? What are you doing? I, I thought I could get him for excessive use of horn if he keeps doing that, I tell you that much. Let's just go have a word of him, see if he needed anything. Alright, buddy. Uh, I just got a question for you. Yeah? Yeah, no, no emergency, just a question. That, our van we just got over there, um... Are, are we allowed to, uh... Go mobile with that, like the hot dog stand, and set up areas where we can sell things. Uh, what do you mean by things? Well, you know we are a bar. So sell so alcohol on not the road. We don't want people. Oh. Yeah, we don't want people. No, not on the road. We mean like drive to a location, set up a perimeter, you know, where people can't leave the area, you know. So we don't want the whole open carry down a street thing, but you know. Like the hot dog stand over there, you know, they have their own little confined area. Yeah. But it's also a mobile thing where they can pick it up and move it to a different location. Yeah, there is a difference between hot dogs and alcohol. And my concern yeah, with... I just, just run it by you. Yeah, my concern with that, I'm not sure... I don't nine. think it's technically illegal, but... I don't know, my concern with that is... If you're... Selling it on the side of the road, then the people who are going to be buying it is going to be people who drink. Sound muted. Uh, I don't mean like on the side of the road, literally. I mean like pulling off the road into an area, you know, like a parking lot. Let's say we go, we decide to go down to the city, and there's a parking lot that somebody allows us, to, an owner allows us to be in, and uh, they have to stay in the remain the confines of that parking lot, and they cannot drive away, you know, if they've had drinks, you know. And if they do, we call the cops, but. Something like that. Otherwise, we can just use it as a marketing van, but, you know, we're just trying to see what we can and can't do with it. Um, well, the marketing van thing, I have no um, no objection to that, but the selling stuff in a car park, I mean, technically speaking, it's not illegal, so I can't stop you doing it, but it just seems like a bad idea. Yeah, and then you could uh, use it as a marketing van, maybe put your logo on the side, drive around a bit. I need to find somebody who uh, knows how to do some good uh, paint work for uh, these things. <laughs> you and I both, brother. I uh, couldn't even English yeah, then. Yeah, well, that's all I really wanted is to ask you the question, see what your opinion was on it, see if it was technically illegal, but uh, appreciate it. No, as far as I know, it's not illegal. If another officer tells you that it is, then he probably knows better than me, but as far as I know, okay, it's right. perfectly legal. I hope appreciate that's correct. It, all right, have a nice day, guys. Awesome. Yep. You too. Okay, well that was okay, weird. Yeah, I was just got to tell you everything. I oh, reversed out of there fast, man. That was not good. Oh. oh my god, are they sleeping? Dude, I've never seen that before. That's so cute. Oh, you can hear them. Oh, I want one. I don't care that they're wild coyotes. No, don't run away, buddy. Dude, that's so cute. Oh, I scared it. Well, there goes that. I've never, ever seen that before. Wait for this car to pass before I walk out. That's really cool. I've never, ever seen that. I didn't know they did that. I thought they just randomly spawned, ran out in front of you, and then despawned. But evidently, that's not the case. That's so cool. I've got a funny feeling about this guy behind us. Hmm. I know, that doesn't look like the type of car you go to the shop in. That looks like the type of car you overtake grannies in. Is he going to follow us around here? Let's see what he does. He might have turned off down that little dirt road. There he is. 
Come on, buddy, do something. I dare you. So hard to keep my eye on the road and the car behind. Hmm, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pull into the bank down here and see if he goes past, like, if he takes the advantage to speed past us or anything stupid like that. I don't know, I just don't trust this dude. Um. 10 4. Okay, I'm stuck on the sign. 67 miles per hour in a 50 whilst blowing his horn. Okay. Yep, yeah, you're getting it, dude. Go on, keep incriminating yourself. I'll love it. Whoa! Fucking hell! Dude, what the fuck was that? Let's pay back for the last episode when I pulled in front of him. Okay. Okay, dude. What is your explanation for this one gonna be? Stop. No, not on the train tracks. Cut the horn and fall forwards. Now I'm on the train tracks. San Andreas 252. 252. Show me in another unit on a 1050 on Panorama and Joshua Road on a red Buffalo S. I'm not going to mention how he cut me up like that, but... Hey, Sheriff. Keys out the ignition. Why? Take your keys out of the ignition, hammer the keys. But, uh, this is going to go south. Because I'm asking you to, man. So take your keys out of your ignition and give Look me the that. keys. Look at that, so cool. I mean, well, why? This is not going to end well. Because you're burning out right now, um, and oh, you've just done donuts, and I just, yeah, uh, I'd just I rather you give out? me the keys. But Let alone the fact I, I clocked him doing 67 in a 50. Oh, there you go, man. Over. So you're on, a, like you're on a traffic stop right now, okay? Which means that you've been detained yeah. for the purpose of an investigation, okay? Yeah, under, so yeah, you've been clocked, there's evidence which has um, showed you going over the speed limit um, and the burnouts and uh, the vandalizing um, government property with uh, what did I vandalize? your um, burnouts. It is because you're technically you're that dirt is correct. Onto our vehicle that's vandalizing. Is dirt okay. really government property though? Dirt isn't, no, but the uh, police cars are. Okay, well, I mean, I'm talking to you now, so I, I don't really think I need it's necessary to take the keys out. I just want you to take the keys out. I just, I've, I'll feel I'll much the safer off, if you took the keys out. Sir, so take I'll the keys out of the ignition now. I'll I will not take the keys out. I want you to remove the keys. I'm going to be productive. I'm going to get his plate. 49QFJ877. Just turning your engine off. I want you I to take the keys out. I am actually going to type that into my phone to save it. In case we need a bolo, because i got a feeling this guy's going to run. Can't you compromise here, man? QFJ877. How about I turn the car off and I don't take them out? This dude is seriously right now, playing with me. Yeah, it is. I can turn it yeah. off right now. I've got the it's, 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 it's not really a request. It's more of a command. I'm asking you to. Uh, I'm telling you to give me the keys. Turn your ignition off and give me the keys. But um, you know. Are you fair? So what you're saying here is that you're failing to comply. I. That is a criminal offence, and you will get arrested, why. sir. We will well, explain no, to you in a minute once you take your keys out of the ignition. Do it now. I will turn the car off, but I won't take the keys out. That's not what we're asking. We're asking you to take the keys out of the ignition after you've turned it can't off. Can't be reasonable here. I stopped for you. I didn't run. So why can't you be, you know... Yeah, you did stop about 
five, probably half a mile after we put our sirens on, and then you took about. Okay, but am I running right now? No, I am not. So why can't I just turn the, the car off? For the no, but right now, no, right, <laughs> right now you're you, you're eluding. Okay, you, you you're sitting here. You're not listening to me. Okay. Um, I'm applying to you. And to you're you. basically resisting a peace officer. Okay, so I'm asking, I'm telling you to remove the keys and hand them hand, hand me keys. Okay, so um, I'll turn the car off. But not, that you know, white that's male, not black option, hair, okay? there's, striped there's no compromise, shirt. there's no... I'm not requesting, I'm telling I mean, you I to remove leave. the keys. I'm taking I mean, as much that? info as I can on this dude. But, or not, because like I say, white at this time you're detained for the purpose of investigation. Male, okay. okay, so I'll turn the car off, but I will not take hair. I want you to give me the keys, I don't trust Gray, you just turning your ignition off. I want you to give me the keys you. to the vehicle. Striped if you don't, this is your last chance, okay, if you don't, um, then I'm going to basically force the keys out, as well as you out of the vehicle, and arrest you um, for evading a peace officer. Okay. That will not be. Stop Just do it the Take easy way. Foot off the okay. Two five two priority. That vehicle's making our southbound panorama. Continuing south panorama, high rate of speed. It's a red Buffalo S. This dude's not going away. It's Charger versus Charger. Two truckers in the area. Get in pursuit. Uh, one two four is going to be secondary in that pursuit. Over. I think we should get a pit on this guy. Request permission to pit while he's on the highway. If we miss this opportunity, we won't get one later. Come on, dude, give it up. I don't think we have a dispatcher. No one's answering. 252, the speeds are too excessive to hit right now. 10 4. Yeah, that's probably. Yeah. 112, I've gone clocked at. 112 miles per hour. What are you gonna do, Sunshine? Continuing straight. I've got units on my 6, so. Secondary, can you call it? 10 4. Going north to north freeway right now. Coming up on Union. Correction. Stay straight on uh, some more way. I'm not letting this dude get away. I have a full description of him, the car, and even his number plate. He's not getting away. If we do lose him, we're going to have a bolo for his arrest. We might even raid his house if he has a registered address. Still headed towards Polito Bay. Hundred and fifteen miles an hour. We're too fast for a pit, which sucks. He is all over the road as well. If I do see a good opportunity, I'm gonna go in for a pit though. At lower speeds. We're coming up on Polito Bay now. I am right on this guy's ass. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. That now in oncome traffic. He's gonna crash. If he doesn't crash, I'll be amazed. We just need a stick on his ass until he does crash, then we'll deal with that. Where's the secondary? Secondary units lost size, can the first unit call it? We are... Uh, stand by. Polito Boulevard, heading towards the sheriff's station. Still high rate of speed. Continuing Polito Boulevard. Going left, left, back towards the highway. Back towards the highway, he's turning round. Head in towards Beaker Garage, turning left again. Another left by the hospital. Come on dude, I'm not letting you get away. Heading back towards the sheriff's station. Taking a right, right. Where is he? I've lost eyes. I've got him. He's headed towards the church. The church. Locations. Shots fired. Shots fired. Shots fired. I have the vehicle heading southbound Procopio. 
Correction, northbound. He just struck an officer. 10 4, lethal force authorised. 10 4. Right, lethal force is authorised. We hit that fence. That was, we I'm missed the brakes. 10 4, heading northbound, northeast Polito Boulevard. Handbrake turn. Oh, my audio fucked up then. Heading past the bank. I'm gonna ram him. I'm gonna ram him next opportunity I get. Back towards the gas station. Where are you going, buddy? Drift! <laughs> Back down Polito Boulevard towards Shower Station. I'm gonna hit him. I'm gonna ram him. Almost missed that corner then. Drift into a lamppost. Back on the highway heading towards the gas station. Come on, dude. I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna. Uh, God damn it. I'm driving worse than him right now. I'm keeping up though. Back on Plito Boulevard heading towards the sheriff's station. Shots fired, shots fired. Sorry, AI. Back towards the gas station. Two can play at that game. Um, if he wants to do handbrake turns, then... Come on. Continuing West Bank Procopio. Where the fuck are you going, dude? No. Damn it, I crashed. So is he. He's on foot, he's on foot by the um, bar. A dead location, I'm by the car. Don't move, don't move. He's down the lane. Uh, I can't look behind me. God damn it. One at Taser Point. Stop pointing, dude. One at Gun Point. Watch Cross, watch Cross. Stop. Stop. You're about to get Taser shot. Taser deployed. Oh, he's magically cuffed. You better stop, I'm fixing to shoot you. On hey, your you knees. You're gonna shoot an unarmed person, man? My hands are up, how are you gonna shoot me? You already hit an officer with a car. That's, that's all the force we need. We stop also have walking. reason to believe he has a gun. Stop walking! Alright, home, citizen interaction, cuff. We have one fifteen. We're just gonna be cooked for it. Oh, you guys follow Can us. I put him in your car? I got a divider in my car, I'll put him in mine. No, I, I, I got one in mine, we can put him in mine. Time for. I'll get rid of this menu in a second, guys, just go bear with me. Now the car over there is beat to hell. Why didn't you stop when I had the gun pointed at you over there by the church? You hit me, you know that, right? I mean, I know you weren't gonna shoot me. Before we question him, we should read him his rights so it's admissible in court. I'll go around here. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you can send him, we'll, can and will. Right to an attorney. You cannot afford an attorney, won't be. Right, since I read them to you. He cut that yep. quite a bit then. So you wanna. What, what was the stop about, first of all? Uh, I clocked him to in 67, uh, down 68. I went to chase him and he was blasting his horn and he sped past the other units. We both flipped on him, pulled him over and we asked him to um, give us his keys because he was doing burnouts and he refused to and then he fled. All right, well, so far the charges are felony reckless and uh, felony... Um, I don't know if you would do vehicular mens or uh, attempt a vehicular homicide on a uh, officer or... Correct me if I'm wrong, but we had shots fired as well. 
I know for a fact my vehicle got shot I, at. I shot. Well, he might have shot well, at you, you but I shot at him. him. You guys but shot. I my shot it. Well, that's what your shots fired are. Did they you shoot on? You uh, by the hospital. I shot no one, but you guys shot my car. I was talking to the officer. I'm heading towards the sheriff's station. Did you hey, well, shoot by the I, hospital? I opened fired on him when he when he started to come at me with his vehicle. I was outside of my car, gun drawn. Ten foot. He come at my when he come when he come at me with the uh, car. I opened fire on him. I heard and, shots uh, fired on he, the he, um, Boulevard Polito Boulevard down by the bank. I assumed that was him. Two five two one two two five two one two four direct. Two five two, go ahead. What's your uh, twenty? We are by the bar in Polito um, in Polito Bay. If you go by the sheriff's station, head towards the hospital, take a left by the bar, and you'll see the red car. We're down the lane below. That was the worst description ever so given. Far. So, um, he went to take off on me. When he went to take off, he, he flipped a U-turn, and I was out of my vehicle, guns drawn. Ordering him out of the vehicle, he come at me, and I end up opening fire on him. So the shots you might have heard might have been me. I'm not sure. Okay. Trying to get back up and get in my vehicle. He hit me, but he did hit me. That's why I thought he had a weapon. Yes. Okay, we'll disregard any weapons charges except the... Um, it's, uh, is it assault with a deadly Search weapon? Him. No, I haven't searched him um, yet. I'm going to say, I mean, he hit me. I don't know if you... I mean, the highest one we could put is a temp officer with a vehicle. That's, that's the highest one. I think assault with a deadly oh, weapon or something like that. Let's not go over the top, but he still needs to be charged with something. Well, I, I mean, I understand. We, there, I did break. Uh, I did break leather and open fire on him. That's the thing, though. Okay. All right, I'll go search him. Search him, and I'll go search the vehicle. Okay. What's your name, sir? What's your name? My name. Yes. Do I, I don't really. What did he do say? I have to give that to you? Are yes, you, you do. You have the remite right to remain silent. You, you do have the right to remain silent, but you also have the you have to identify yourself okay, to police so officer. Okay, I'm gonna exercise that right right about now. Okay, well you don't have to say anything, but I am going to inform you this car was searched before every patrol, so anything found in the back will be associated to you. Can you uh, step out of the vehicle? Also, oh, you're going to frame me now. No, I'm informing you this vehicle was clean, spotless, and we have evidence of that before every shift. No, that'd be a stupid thing to do. We're on dash cam. And we don't do that anyway. Well, you know. Right. Well, I wouldn't put and one more thing, guys, I know though. you said that I know you said that you didn't didn't vehicle is being impounded. And I've gotta make a make an inventory. The funny thing about so, that vehicle is I just bought it at an auction after you guys took it from some other dude. And now it's getting impounded again. That's what's really funny about this situation. No, you shouldn't be an idiot. I mean, you guys. I'm gonna go back in and talk for you. All you guys, you could have resolved the situation if you know all you let me do is turn off the car. But you guys weren't flexible at all, so you know this is what happens. I thought you said you had no weapons on you. When did I say that? I said I didn't shoot anybody or shoot at. No, anybody. you said you wouldn't shoot an unarmed man. That implies you have no weapons on you. My hands are up. Therefore, I was not armed. Okay. Well, is this pistol registered to you? Yep. I'm going to confiscate that. Okay. Well, it's going to be uh, confiscated off you right now because you're under arrest. If and when you get out of prison, you can apply to have that back, but I'll admit that's pretty unlikely to happen. San Andreas 223. Can I get a 1070 oh, I mean, on Deluzo Avenue in Polito Bay? Okay. Have close, you close had anything to drink today? 3011 zero one zero. and 3010. I'm oh, sorry, say I'm again? I'm fully aware of how I had zero drinks and I'm fully aware of how you guys try to hassle me at that traffic stop. Well, you can submit a formal report if you like. I'll sue you guys for harassment. Okay. I'm fine with that. Everything you've done is on dash cam by multiple officers, and it will all be recorded I mean, you and also saved. Guys flexible at all. You basically talked me into fleeing. No, we didn't tell you to flee. <laughs> we gave you a legal you order. God damn it. Okay, my my vehicle was running. You wanted the keys out. 
meeting in the middle is turning the vehicle off altogether. You guys won't even do that. So well, if we did take well, the no, keys out, we would. Keys still in the ignition. Why would I want to help you guys out if you're not going to help me out at all? But so your way of throwing a tantrum, having a paddy fit, is by taking off from us, increasing your charges, then also shooting at officers. That's your way of, of it making it point. Because now, oh, now no. we're making a good. Because now, now we're going to make a good out. point. He, uh, I opened fire on him because he, he uh, ran me down with his vehicle. Yeah, I did find a pistol no, on him though when I searched him. Down, how are you standing here right now? Alright, man, well, well, yeah, yeah, so, the, it is what it is, you know, you, you, you're upset with us, but you took off at the end of the day, the law is the law, you fled from us, um, you, you assault, uh, you assaulted a peace officer with, um, a, with a deadly weapon, oh, you'll, you'll have your heyday, sir, but at this time, Whoever's like, uh, at like the officer's already, back window, I want to press charges on them. If an officer okay, opened fire on you, it's because he was in threat for his life, and if that if he's in threat with his life, then he is able to open fire to save his life. That's yeah, reasonable force. Threatening my life, so I'm able to, to shoot at you. No, yeah, not sure, at all. You can contest. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Can... I don't think that that's the way this works. Okay, we don't pull our guns and shoot people. Just run me down I mean, with I your vehicle. That's when I could. No, no. Hush for a second. Listen. Sit there and run me down. Attempting to get away from me, and I opened fire on you. I opened fire on you because you were trying to kill me. Might have not been trying to, but you have a vehicle that weighs 2,000, 3,000 pounds coming at me, driving it with you in control. Then you're trying to kill a police officer. Yep, yeah, you're also a danger to every me. single person in the state of San Andreas by driving like that. I this clocked you on my radar me. at over 113 miles per hour. I mean, you were doing it too. I've been yeah, trained to do he it. Was pursuing you. I've been okay, trained to do it. I have lights and sirens let's... to alert people that I'm doing it. You are just flying on the wrong side of the road, might I add, on the hard shoulder at 100 miles per hour plus. If you'd hit a single one of those cars, you could have killed a family. Yeah, but you could have killed me if you ran into me going those speeds. Well, well that's why he was chasing you, and at, at, at a couple of points he requested authorization to... Uh, so it could have been a whole lot worse for you. It could have been this, it could have been that. We and could stand exactly, here all day. But as exactly it stands why. at this time, um, yeah, as, as it stands at this time, this officer's registered your rights. Um, you're under caution as it stands at the minute, so the officer just very simply wants to search you, remove your pistol, and then you'll be charged down at the station. You'll have your chance for your appeal and to complain about anything or any experience you had during your pursuit, which is most likely going to be um, disregarded by the courts because of your uh, because of the fact you were fleeing. Okay, weed. so as, as it stands, felony of, um, felony eluding is obviously a criminal effect, uh, offense. All right, so that's what's going to happen, man. You're going to jail. End of. And 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 just before you know, um, all three vet dash cams will be in, be involved with the court. So I my dash cam will too. reveal that you, my dash cam will reveal that you trying to run me down, and the other I'm officer that actually shoot me. I I know I tried to shoot you. I only opened fire when you came at me, and that's what's going to be shown on the dash cam. I'm done talking. I, I'm done talking to you. I'll put him back I'm not in the, the vehicle. Judge. I'm not the jury. I'm just the uh, I'm just the middleman. Put you in the back of my vehicle. And I'm gonna take you down to. Did you, you find anything in the car, charges. trooper? I found some weed, a couple of blunts, that's it. No, it's not worth charging over, to be honest. But at this point, with him yeah, acting like that, I can charge him over every little thing. But... Well, yeah, yeah, we could throw some criminal speed in. Well. <laughs> I ain't worried about it. We're, the, the, we're going to get more out of the felonies and get more. Yeah. Right, the, I'll uh, call a uh, tow for the vehicle. Ooh, game freeze. I've already got one in route. Uh, it was going to be county tow. Ah, 10 4. Uh, what station you want to take him down to? Just take him down to Polito. Yeah, yeah, Polito's the closest. If you want, um, you can take him down and I'll uh, meet the county tow if you go, what I'm saying. What's his name? I know he ain't going to tell me, so. He refused to tell me as well. I'll tell you guys. No. Okay, what's your name then? Jake Smith. Sound resumed. Sound number 252. I also might disclose that I may not be telling the truth. But you know, I gave you a name. 
Two. Can you run a twenty-seven twenty-nine on a Jake Smith? My car is totaled. The brake lights gone, all the windows are gone. Damn, man. I drove this thing to shit. 252, the name's going to come back to a white male. Date of birth of 1994. Valid driver's license. One, two arrests for reckless driving and DUI. Time for thank you. Yeah, if you take care of him, I'll take care of the car. Uh, Sheriff, you might need to move your vehicle. Right, let's have yeah, a sure, man. let's have a quick run back to the car. Candy Toe is arriving on scene. County one two four. One two four. Show me ten eight. Um, go ahead, detach me from that uh, from that call. Two five two same traffic. Santa Cruz two two three en route to Polito Bay Station. Uh, actually, no, I, I can't go back on patrol yet. Two five two, can you show me ten seven for a few mics? I need a new vehicle. Ten four. Yeah, my car is absolutely destroyed. Look at the bumper; it's hanging off. If I break the bumper, <laughs> that's great. I like that. Right, we're just gonna get back to the station now and get a new vehicle. Okay, guys, we got a new uh, new car. It's a 14 Charger, uh, I think. 40. Uh, I think it's 14. I have no idea. Yeah, 14 Charger, and the other ones are 15. I still get that confused. And this car's not as good looking as the other one, but it has a better light bar. 252, go ahead. What were the charges on Mr. Smith? That you had for him? Um, we were going to book him with felony evasion, uh, I believe assault with a deadly weapon, and reckless driving. And anything else you want to throw at him? Temple. Right, well, that is uh, Mr. Jake Smith taken care of. And we are now going to be back on patrol. Okay, guys, we're responding to one of the most important things of the day. Uh, code 1 response. Central 223. Because at the Yellow Jack, something major is going on. Discount on coffee and donuts. Wow. I was wondering what is the loud noises over here. Yeah. I have only really gotten into comment. the arrest report. muted. Oh, I heard there was uh, discounted donuts and coffee. Absolutely, come on right on in. Perfect, because the uh, priority response right here. <laughs> wow. Let's just unmute it's my thing reasonable. just in case something happens I need to call in. 10-4, are you able to remove stuff or no? Yes, I am. I'll take um, a coffee, a uh, black a one sugar, and a ring donut, please. Alrighty, uh, I believe. Uh, oh wow, he's actually there. giving it to me. Two, two, three. Yeah. To dispatch. Go ahead. I was going to RP uh, this. So... Felony evading, felony reckless, and vehicular assault on peace officer. There's your coffee for you. Perfect. How Ten much four. will that be? Like a sandwich, but it's really a donut. Thank you. So, okay. Sure. How much uh, will that be? Just, just uh, two dollars today for you. Two dollars? Damn. I need to come here more often. I tell you what, I'm I mean, gonna. Yeah, we're always sort of trying to be around here and you know get your business. Oh yeah, well the office. You are man, keep the change. Here. I think hey, I gave it to the wrong person. Ah, uh, well I'll pass it on. No, I, I got it. Oh, you got it good. Okay. Keep the change, man. Yeah, that was uh, very cheap. Oh well, yeah, you I know, appreciate you guys it. Keeping us safe here, so that's all we at least we can do for you. Yeah, we've had a lot of uh, run-ins around here with um, some criminals, so, you know, we appreciate you coming by and, you know. Mm, this coffee's delicious, but yeah, uh, any time, man. That's what we're here for. Any yeah, luck on you. uh, finding your van from uh, before? Uh, sorry, your bike? Hey, oh, the bike. We haven't found his bike yet. Um, yeah, I keep yeah. It. this is my, one of my general managers. Um, yeah, our bartender's bike got stolen earlier today, and yeah, no, we still haven't found it yet. Oh man, that sucks. 
Well, yeah, give him my say, uh, give him my best regards on um, finding it or getting an insurance claim on it. But as I said, we're still looking for it. Okay, guys, we've had our donuts and our coffee. We're um, nice and refreshed. Well, saying that, we've still got quite a bit left in our food bar to go. But now I am going to take a nice leisurely drive up to um, Sandy Shores and I will let you know what happened with the guy in the buffalo because we just had a chat, me and 223, the arresting officer. Uh, Jake Smith was not his name. That was the name of a random civ and now Jake Smith, whoever that is, has a record as long as your arm for stuff he did not commit and we're trying to fix that at the moment. So the civ we did arrest is now in jail and he's going to be there for a very, very long time. And I mean that literally. We give him an extra big punishment just for giving us the wrong name. But yeah, I'm sure he'll be sorted on uh, Jake's record. Nothing too permanent, I hope. Anyway, guys, I'm going to call it a uh, day here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And just ignore the fact that half the people we spoke to had no arms. That's because of a... Um, a mod we used to use but we don't anymore called EUP and I, I guess and I still have it somewhere on my computer installed so it makes some people look ridiculous. But as I said, thank you so much for watching, make sure you come back for the next episode and I will see you then. Peace out guys.